iOS 16.3 is available to download now. Here is everything new for your iPhone. Welcome everybody to Apple Insider. It is Andrew here and as I said, Apple has released iOS 16.3 and you can download it right now on your iPhone. Apple's also released several other software updates including 16.3 for HomePods, tvOS 16.3 for your Apple TV, we've got stuff for your Apple Watch, for your Mac. All these updates are coming out right now and you can download them. In this video I'm specifically going to focus on iOS 16.3 and a little bit with iPadOS 16.3 since there's so much crossover between iPhones and iPads. Here's everything that is new. Starting off, Apple's adding support in this update for the all new second generation HomePod. Now please don't comment on this HomePod, I was not mine, somebody sent it over this way and it's very dirty, it's super gross, but the new HomePod is supported with the new iOS 16.3. 16.3 adds the new Unity wallpaper for your iPhone and there's a corresponding wallpaper over on your Apple Watch as well. This is of course just in time for Black History Month and to celebrate black culture. For security updates, Apple now has the option to add a physical security key to your Apple ID. So you can use something like a YubiKey to use a hardware authentication feature to your Apple ID. You can set this up via settings. So if you're very particular about your Apple ID, one, make sure all your stuff is as secure as possible. This is another great way to do that. So no one can sign into your Apple ID without having your physical hardware security key as another way of verification. Then Apple has updated how emergency SOS works on iPhone. Now you'll have to hold either the up or down volume buttons along with the side button to activate emergency SOS. This new change is designed to help cut down on accidental and inadvertent emergency SOS calls that have been plaguing first responders. Other than that, Apple has added a bunch of new uh, bug fixes and security updates in this update, so be sure to download it now and check it out. By the way, there's also a ton of new features coming to HomePod Mini with this update, so be sure to check out my other video where I walk through all of those updates and new features. Let me know what you think down below in the comments or on Twitter at Andrew underscore OSU. Otherwise, I'll catch you on the next video.